not. Hi everyone, it's me Darlene. I am doing a quickie video in the house because I feel kind of guilty that I went to Shaw's and I didn't bring my camera with me. It is because I in no way expected to be going to Shaw's. And yes, I went in this hairdo exactly as you see it. I uh, ran out to go pick up my mother's dentures. She popped a tooth biting into a peach that I bought her the other day. Expensive peach. And um, the denture place is right next to Shaw's. So they called and said it was ready. And when I went down to pick it up, I thought, this is the final day of the 79 cent Shaw's frozen vegetables. And I really wanted to pick some of those up. So I thought, even though I'm in my house clothes, which is only marginally worse than the clothes I wear out, <laughs> I thought I would run in and get some veggies. What bothered me the most is that I had no clue how much room I'd have in my freezer. I do know that I, I can rearrange because things are just like thrown in there. So I bought 20 bags of frozen vegetables. Oh my goodness, I'm so hot all the time. I want 50 degrees. Oh. <laughs> water. I do have water available. I actually have some in my big cup that we've had for, I don't know, probably since I was a teenager. <sighs> that was lukewarm. Um, okay, so what, 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 what was I saying? So, 79 cents a bag for the veggies. Awesome price. I totally need veggies. So I bought 20 bags and I'm hoping that I can make room for them. As a matter of fact, let's go look in my freezer. First, there's the veggies. I got mostly, oh, I got some turnip greens with the diced turnips. We love those. I wanted spinach, but they didn't have any spinach at that price. And there are 16 ounce bags. So that's a really good price. And I got, you know, a lot of the broccoli, cauliflower mixes all those like Italian blend and just cut broccoli and some zucchini. So quite happy about all that. Now, this is the disastrous freezer with things just thrown around and I'm quite sure I can make some room. So let me do that and then I'll show you. I am seriously dying from the heat. I still only have one AC up in my house. Oh, let me turn Judge Judy down. Um, I still have another AC that I have to put in my window, but it's a big AC that takes more than just me. So uh, I might just break down and put another small unit in there. Um, okay, so I um, rearranged in a very non-organized way. I was just concerned with making room and all I took out was, what did I take out? Some bread. That's probably been in there way too long, so that's going to go for the squirrels and the birds. And then I took out... What else did I take out? Oh, I condensed... I had two half boxes of ice cream in there, so I condensed that to one box. And I at least know now where all my veggies are and where all my meat is. And I found a piece of fish that I'll be happy to eat. And, okay, let's go look. Am I, like, zoomed or something? Oh, there we go. Ta-da! There's the bottom drawer. Almost all veggies. Some meat. You might see the hamburg that I bought the other day. And then I have a lot of pork up there in bags. And, and uh, I like to freeze and then put them in bags so that I know what is there. If I want to grab meat, I just grab a bag. And there's the condensed ice cream. That ice cream is delicious. Sea salt caramel truffle. And uh, just some of the things. There's a big bag of grapes. So I'm happy, happy, happy camper. Now, my goal is to actually eat what I have in there. I want to be done with the days of hoarding my food and never wanting to eat anything that I buy for fear that I'll never have it again. So uh, I absolutely love veggies, love frozen veggies. And those of you who know me know that... I love the veggies so much that I don't put butter or salt. Sometimes a pinch of salt, but most often I don't. Um, I do like some pepper, though. 
and I just like to taste the vegetables. So I'm gonna allow myself a whole bag of veggies a day if I want. I'm gonna just like go all out and eat what I feel like eating. I'm just gonna keep watching for sales and when the veggies go on sale I'm gonna stock up and I'm not buying anything else for the freezer for now until I make some veggie room. But anyway, so I just thought that I would uh, check in with you and I'm very glad that my mother's teeth are fixed. She, she busts a tooth like every year. And whatever. What can I do? I try to remind her not to bite in apples or peaches or corn on the cob with her teeth, but that's what teeth are for. want to use them for biting. So that's it. I will be back with more soon. Bye!